Welcome to this short tutorial. In this tutorial we're going to learn how to create a log curve and use the value of that log curve to change, to add variation to one, one feature that we create in our model. So the first thing that we have to do for creating a log curve, we have to create a new model. So please go to Tools, Create Features and Create Model. So let's type, we call it low curve. Okay. So now we have to go to the top view since we want to work in the X and Y plane. And let's cancel up the camera. Okay. So let's save this transaction. And the first, the next thing that we have to do is we're going to create our low curve by control points, so we need to create first a locker frame and our control points. So let's do that. So we have to go to locker frame. We're gonna do it from plane. So our plane is gonna be the locker base ES XY plane. The dimensions in X, I just want to create three three units. In, in Y dimension let's create 10. In X axis is asking me how many divisions I want to have in X and since I have three I want to do it each one unit so I have to use the function called series. Between 0 and 3 I want each one unit one division and hit OK. In Y axis, I have to do the same type series between 0 and 10 every one unit. And hit OK. Let's hit OK. And here just make sure that we're in the top view. OK. There we go. Let's save our transaction. And now that we have to place the control points to create the low curve, so let's choose the point tool. But before to create a, the points inside our our locker frame, we have to hit control to make sure that we're working on that. So just make hit control, get closer, and hit and create three points. And there we go. Here in our in the symbolic diagram we can see that the points were created inside our coordinate system in low curve. So that is fine. And let's save this transaction. And let's go to create new feature. Let's go to low curve. We're going to do it by control points. The locker frame is the low curve that we created. The, the frame. So we're going to select it. The control points are the points that we created as well. So I can do it selecting from the symbolic diagram or from the model. So I can select the first one, just hit control and keep selecting the other ones. Now we have all of our points. We're going to create the curve by points to have more control of the value. The order is going to be 3. I want to create a curve. And the independent variable, I want to do it. I want to create three positions. So I have to type series between 0 and 3 each one unit since I create three divisions. So let's hit OK and hit OK. So now we have our log curve. Now let's go to the to the original model and let's cancel the camera. Let's go to the top view and let's just create one point. 
so now the, let's save the transaction the feature that I just going to create is something very simple I'm just going to create a circle and I'm going to use the option by center by center radius and uh, the center is going to be the point that I create the radius here is, is where I'm going to use the value of the log curve to use it as the radius as the input of the radius of this circle and I can control it from the log curve so I have to choose here the log curve that I create is log curve 01 but then I have to type I have to hit dot and I have to go to the option I have to hit D and we're gonna use dependent variable and I'm gonna use the index 1 is the the value 1 of the log curve so I have to hit OK the support is going to be it, it's asking me for in which plane I want to draw that circle so I'm going to choose the base yes, x y plane and now let's hit OK and we have our, our circle so now if we go to our log curve and we modify the position of this point of the point one we're gonna see that we are controlling the dimensions of the point of the circle well that's all for this short tutorial if you have any suggestion questions please go to the forum and pose a question there and the GC team we are going to be happy to help you and if you want to explore different features please go to the next to the next tutorial and i think i hope that this tutorial will be helpful in one way thank you